Hello, Betty. How nice you look. Thanks, Auntie. 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 Already, Auntie. Sorry, Mummy. Auntie, Mummy, Mummy, Auntie. Sorry. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Sit, Betty. Sit. So now tell me, what is your plan? Women enact for themselves. A program created by Enact Arts. Plays written by women or people who identify as women and about women, but not only for women. This is a year-long residency program. We will be offering fellowships to six um, promising storytellers and we will give them the opportunity to develop stories that will then be performed and produced under the Enact banner. And through that process, they will be guided by what we call the guiding circle. Women's voices too often within the theater have been diminished and having strong women behind creates strong women in the front of the stage and developing the scripts. All my life, I've tried to reimagine and uh, reconfigure women's stories, stories from the soil I grew up in. History had a way in the last few centuries of brushing female achievements under the, the carpet. And it is up to us as a society to make sure that that doesn't happen anymore. And so I am very committed to telling women's stories and raising women's voices. I hope that WEFT is able to create a dialogue and, you know, not always play safe. I know that we want what WEFT creates to be a safe space, but I also know that many of us who are in the original guiding circle believe that it must be a brave space. Why not be provocative? Why not make people sit up a bit? Why not ruffle a few feathers? And if people walk out, it's okay. It's fine as long as we create a dialogue because we really live at a time where politics and economics and art and practice and domestic life and gender roles are all coming together, especially now. So I just want to say to all my WEFT sisters, thank you for inviting me to be a part of this Yaya sisterhood. And look, let's just do wonderful things. And I know that we will. WEFT brings women together to write, direct, and produce their stories. And I am humbled to be the first writer creator with an ACT's WEFT program. As a woman uh, who had a very long list of no-nos confronting her in life, uh, I sort of made it my mission that I was going to do two things. A, I was going to support and amplify women's voices, and I was going to take it upon myself to tell the story of some incredible women that, whose stories need to be told, whose stories need to be in uh, the global mix of, of stories of the world. Weft. The imagery is beautiful. Just think of a loom and the warp and weft and the shuttles going back and forth and the minute attention to detail as they really want both the fabric, the weave and the design to come together. Well, it's an idea whose time has come. It's great that there are women behind this company and they're hearing and reading uh, those voices and encouraging them to use and act as a pathway. I'm very, very much looking forward to the WEFT program taking off and us growing it uh, to from six to 60 and then 600 fellows, hopefully at some point in the near future.